Welcome to BrainStuff, a production of iHeartRadio. Hey, BrainStuff, Lauren Vogelbaum here. Someone needs to erect a statue of Josephine Cochrane. If it weren't for this American inventor, all of us might be washing dirty dishes by hand. Though, to be fair, the closest thing we have in my house to a mechanical dishwasher is me. Cochrane lived a well-heeled life and loved to entertain her many friends. Over the course of time, though, her household servants had chipped their fair share of the family's 17th century china. Frustrated, Cochrane began washing the dishes herself, a task she hated. She wondered why someone hadn't invented a machine to make it easier. In 1886, she took matters into her own dishpan hands and built the first practical dishwasher, improving on an 1850 design by one Joel Houghton. Houghton's device was hand-cranked and only splashed water on dirty dishes— Cochrane's washer was more thoughtful. It had a motor that turned a wheel that pumped hot, soapy water from a boiler over the dishes. It would take a while for Cochrane's dishwasher to catch on, but when it did, people loved it. It was the first commercially successful automatic dishwasher. But what Cochrane didn't know was that hand-washing dishes can be less sanitary than cycling them through the dishwasher. Today's dishwashers use scalding hot water, high-tech spray nozzles, and other features to cleanse dishes— Handwashing doesn't even come close. That's because our hands, as the Washington Post points out, can't withstand water temperatures that modern dishwashers use, up to 145 degrees Fahrenheit, that's 62 degrees Celsius. And according to the Environmental Protection Agency and the U.S. Department of Energy, new Energy Star dishwashers use less energy and water, 5,000 gallons a year, than handwashing does. Moreover, the sponges that we humans use can harbor lots of germs— Scientists have found nearly 400 different species of bacteria on household kitchen sponges, and the density is astronomical, around 45 billion per square centimeter. However, more sanitary doesn't necessarily mean healthier. In 2015, Swedish researchers reported that kids living in households where dishes were hand-washed were less susceptible to allergies compared to children living in households with a dishwasher. The researchers surmised that hand-washing exposed the kids to more microbes, which jump-started their immune systems. 